G'day guys, Taz Gaming back again and we've been a little bit busy overnight. We've made a window, ceiling, door and the door frame which are going to pop over at the entrance to my place. But we've got a couple of visitors over there so instead of pestering them, let's just go see what sort of loot we can find. So let's jump in here first. If we can find a clam then it'd be ideal. Because we're going to need more and more electronics as we come along. There's some sandstone, which I'm not too interested in just yet. So we'll just ignore that for the moment and just continue round. Well, there's our first target. Nice little wooden box, which is always great. More now, this is going to be fantastic. And there we go. There's a bunch more. Excellent. Some more fibre. There's always stacks of fibre just floating about. I'm going to probably have to build another axe as well shortly. It's starting to get a bit low and we're probably going to need another crate or something at home to store all my goodies because we're getting a lot of stuff. Uh, what else have we got around here? Not much else going around here. What are you? I think you're a bunny in there somewhere. I'd... Ah yeah, there you are. Just couldn't make you out. There we go. Nice little shot to begin the day with. That's not too bad. Considering I can see it too well. Look at that, more fibre. And all the exciting stuff, like collecting more wood, which we always need. We're a bit, as I said last episode, we're a bit low. So the more of this we can get, the better. So let's just start getting some of this. If we can spot another deer, that's going to be useful. I've got a bunch of antlers. But having more for more adhesive is not going to be a bad thing at all. So we'll get cracking into this and we'll go to the other big tree. And then we'll have to go check out our power situation because I forgot to see how much we have left. I th Ooh, another little box here. Yeah, I wanted to make another plant bed. Ideally, I'd like to find a locked box today as well, which would be absolutely fantastic. But yeah, you never quite know your luck with that sort of stuff. Again, another one of the benefits to my little place over here. There's three big trees all pretty close together, which is excellent. You can use the grubs for mass as well, so that's a nice little side effect. So we'll just grab this one, and then we'll just head on over to the next one. There we go. Three quick big trees to make um, start the day with, so that's excellent. There's 18 wood, which is all going to be handy. Wolf, I do not want to play with you at the moment. No means no. Just going to keep going this way. We might just hit this tree as well while we're here. Just cause. Oh, he's continuing to follow me. That's it. We'll just keep going. Okay, so how... Okay, so the wolf's over there. How is the front of my house going? Pick up all of this goodness. Ah, oh, wolf is just there next to the crate. Leave the crate alone. Ah, oh, yeah, there's still a bear at the front, which is a little bit annoying. That's okay, we should be able to put up some stuff here. Oh, Mr. Bear. How you going? We're just stuck down here. See if that means if you want to ignore me or not. I want to put a windowed one here. Just so I can see out and murder any hunters. Although it might not be useful, I don't really want that to get destroyed, so that's a thing as well. Now if I just pop the door here, and then you can't see me. Look at that. And put a ceiling on up here. I mainly want some ceilings going on just to protect uh, the little animal coop there from stray Molotov cocktails and all that sort of fun stuff that will happen when hunters get a little bit annoyed with me, which I think they will. Okay, we'll just start this burning. Oh, we're completely full of medicinal herbs. Yeah, definitely going to need another crate, which I might make tonight, I think. Let's have a quick look in here. Nothing needs harvesting. Yeah, we'll come back to that. I'd like to put some more stuff down up here. That's pretty okay at the moment. A little bit more ammo is always excellent. Ah, there's a chicken right next to a crate. Oh yes, I was a little bit concerned he was going to move at the last minute there, but no, he stayed there, which is good. Oh, another tomato seed. We might just take that and just go straight back and pop that in our veggie garden. And then that'll make a uh, full box full of uh, tomato seeds in my plant box, so that'll be excellent. Oh, look at that. There's one up there, but there's another wooden box here. Geez, they're throwing them at us today, aren't they? There's some more nails. Excellent. Some more fibre. Never really scarce on fibre here, I'm finding. 
there's always plenty about. Okay, now I'm going to be a little bit cautious. Watch out for hunters that might be fishing along here. I don't really want to run into one. Oh, there goes a bunny. Unfortunate, I didn't see him until the last minute. Well, I didn't see him until he moved, actually. I think there's a hunter. There we go. Just sitting over there. He's going back to his base, so hopefully I can navigate around him and he'll just leave me alone and I can just continue collecting what I want to collect. There's a wolf there as well, which is annoying. Yeah, so it looked like they didn't like me. There was a wolf there, there was a hunter there. I didn't want to really fight both at the same time. So we just head over to the other side, where the bear is, not ideal. But we'll just navigate around that side. Might even see if we can find ourselves a cougar. That might be worthwhile for today. Oh, there's a deer over there. And there's another bunny. I might go follow the deer, actually. Go see if I can try my luck with it a little bit. Getting that deer the other day, well, yesterday, in the water was pretty nice. Okay, let's see how we go. Kind of want to get up over this rise a little bit, just so I can see what the hell I'm aiming at, which is always ideal. Oh. Oh, I got him right on the head there. That was a good shot. I'm happy with that. Okay. The wolf is chasing him. But it looks like the wolf's given up there. Let's just keep following the deer. I didn't want, I didn't want to go around the other way because there was a bear and a, de and a um, wolf. So, not ideal. Okay, we can't keep sprinting. Actually, we'll have a bit of food. There we go. It should keep our guy a bit happier. Now, where's this deer? We scared away a little bit. I don't want to lose him when I had such a good shot on him. He presented his head for me and yeah, that's all I needed. Okay, can't be too far away from here. Is he down this? Yeah, here he is. Excellent. We haven't lost him. If you could turn around again, mate, just so I could get another headshot, that'd be ideal. No, nah, he's walking away, that's okay. We'll get a little bit closer before we get our shot in, I think. Almost a bit of ore there as well, nice. Oh, there's a second... Oh, okay! Yep, yep, this is a second deer. There's that wolf chasing our first deer. So, it's, ignore this one, because we've already started on the other one. Yeah, there we go. Two deers, look at that! Okay, this is going to be tricky. The bloody wolf has just com complicated things just a little bit. Ah! Bastard. The bear took down the deer. That's really annoying. How long does it last? Let's just put some shots into you. Okay, because can I grab you quickly and then go get this deer that he killed? I think I hesitated too long. Yeah, I reckon I did hesitate too long. Damn. It would have been just around here somewhere. Yep. Damn, I should have taken the bear out quicker. But there you go. Uh, there's the other deer. I'll go get this other deer, actually. Um, when the animals kill another animal, then they don't last that very long, unfortunately. Okay, I'm just going to get some higher ground here. It's only slightly higher ground. But hopefully it's going to be enough for me to see. In fact... There we go. Oh, he's gone to water. Nah, damn, he moved it last second there. Okay, he's one hit off. If I can get out of here before he moves too far. Just sneak. Okay. This is it, we've got our deer. If I don't 
Mess this up. Beautiful. There we go. Finally got a deer. We missed out on the first deer because it got eaten by a bear. We did carve the bear open to have a bit of a look for him. But no, there wasn't a second deer in there, unfortunately. Oh, and a locked box. Excellent. Excellent. Look at that. Beautiful. Okay. Let's just have a quick look in here. See what we got. Hopefully something good. Some padded cloth is what I'm really after. Nuts, some tomato seeds, some sinew. <laughs> Seven protein bars. More sinew. Yeah, not too bad. Some more iron fragments to kind of like pay for it. So that's, yeah, it's not too bad. Not exactly what I was hoping for. But yeah, we'll take it all the same. Plus there was a whole bunch of sinew. Where are we? Kill you. Um, yep, eight sinew. So yeah, that's, that's not too bad. We've got to be happy with that. We can't be too unhappy. Some more cotton and stuff is what I'm really after though. Where are you, wolf? Yep, you can stay there. Okay, so we did well with that. Looks like we got something else. No, I thought it was a crate or something just sitting there. Okay, so we'll get back home. And we'll go use the power that's probably sitting there, wasting away. I off the rock, hurt myself, had to bandage myself. Jesus. Have to be a little bit more careful, I think. Just want to keep an eye on this pickaxe. We don't want it to fully break. Ah, uh, there's a bear there. I should be able to get this copper, I'm hoping. Oh, nope. Two bears and a wolf. Nah. Well, leave you alone. I thought I could get it, but there's no way. Yeah, I don't want it to... Excellent. Got another bunny, more cloths. I don't want the pickaxe to fully degrade away, because if it does, then I can't... Swing and jump. Swing and jump. Then I can't use it for mass, is what I'm trying to say. There we go. Just like that. Okay, we're completely full on stuff. We have to get back to base. There's no point in us looking for too much stuff, because we won't better fit it in. Here's another wooden crate. I was just saying we can't get any more stuff, but hey, we're a little bit greedy. We can fit more nails in and stuff in here. What's that we just threw out? Electrical components, which I don't want to throw out. What don't I want? That. Don't really need any more fire starters. We've got plenty. The fire never goes out. Well, we'll collect some more wood while we're here. I don't even have enough space to start making planks. The last thing I want to do is start making planks and then have that and then lose all that. Where are you? Just in there? Yep, there we go. Okay, again we got the same issue. What am I throwing out? Well, what we'll do is we'll eat all those and then we can take you with us. Sounds like the hunters are having a bit of fun somewhere. Probably just shooting some of the local wildlife. Okay, our base is still reasonably secure. It needs more securing than that. It's a little bit bad, but it's okay. We'll work on that. Okay, how much power do we have? Plenty of power. We'll make one more plant bed. Why not? That's going to be useful. Some planks and a few other things. Oh, bear's coming back. That's a bit rude. Let's just pick some of these. And we just picked up some tomato seeds, so why not? There we go. How's this going? Yeah, it's coming along nicely. Okay, bear's just outside our place again. You can just see him on the left there. That's okay, we'll leave our stuff to burn and we'll just do another quick lap around here and pick up all this kelp, I think. There's some more kelp further down, but I don't really need it that much. Then I'm gonna go out my way for it. So we'll pick up this fiber. We've got the another plant bed going and we'll fill that full of veggies when we get back. I just want to use this daylight as much as possible. Whoop, pick you up. I don't know why I'm still picking up the uh, medicinal herbs and stuff. But at least, if nothing else, it's good for uh, mass, I'm guessing. So we'll just pick up these trees again, a little bit more firewood, which we're definitely going to need to use to keep constructing our base. We've got a whole bunch of nails. We've got like 140 or something, which is excellent. But we're just so shy on wood at the moment. Look at that. 
bunch more nows, even as I just said, I had a whole heap of them. Probably heard me and figured, hey, why not just lump a few more onto them, eh? I won't continue up to the last tree because as you can see there's a bear just hovering around out there and it's getting towards night time so I'll hit the little forest that we've got near the um, boulder near our base because we're still close to home that way and so if it does get suddenly dark then I'm hopefully not going to get into too much trouble. We might take the back entrance to my place again I think. So we'll just go around this way and then we'll swim in. Oh, I can hear a wolf behind me. Yeah, definitely behind me. Well, lucky is I've got eaten plenty of food. Oh, and it's... Okay, we're going to have to kill you. There's two crates just sitting there, mate. Okay, come here. There we go. Killed for the greater good. Oh, a couple of steaks, some fat. And where are these little boxes over here? Yep, he had to die. Because I need all this. Especially when there's two sitting next to each other. There you go, there's a little bit more ammo. A shame it wasn't a shotgun shell. A shotgun shell there would have been absolutely fantastic. But there's a bunch more now. There's a whole heap of them. Okay, I'm just trying to have a bit of a look to see where that bear is. I can't see him, but it'll be hovering in the front of my place. So I'll just save myself issues and just swim around here, I think. Oh, there we go. A little bit of mining. Last little bit of mining for the day, I'm guessing. Just having a quick look in here just to see if there's any clams or anything. What's this? Ah, oh, a bit of kelp. No, can't see any clams. It's getting pretty dark as well. Here we go. Another couple of steaks to cook up. Excellent. Okay, we've got our plant box all set to go. We'll just grab a few. I think what we'll do is we'll get all these potatoes because we're going to need these to make molotovs and stuff eventually. So having a surplus of potatoes is going to be ideal. Let's get a bit of light on the situation and park our and park our little planter box there. That'll do just fine. She's a little bit skew if that's okay. Put some tomatoes down and a whole bunch of potatoes. Excellent. Pop some more water in there. And there we go. All good. Pretty much another day dusted, I would say. I'm just burning some of the other meat just so I can use it for mass. There we go. All nice and burnt. Okay, that's about us done for the moment, guys. We've got a nice bit of power and stuff just sitting there, which has been eaten away a little bit. We'll turn that away, turn that off. We've got 19 iron fragments in total and we only need 18 for another key. So I think we'll make another key. And then yeah, look for another locked chest. I don't think it's gonna be a bad idea. What are we up to now? September, so we're starting to get close to winter. And unfortunately, the winter jacket takes four padded cloth and another six cotton. We have got nine cotton, so we can make the four padded cloth but then we still need another five cotton on top of that. And I think, I don't think we've got any more cotton plants going, unfortunately. None there, and none there. So we really need to be on the lookout for more cotton plants. Got plenty of tomatoes and stuff going, which is nice. I think we'll go find a chicken as well and go stick them in there. Feed them on carrots, because we've got a buttload of carrots. And then we'll give them tomatoes and stuff as well. Maybe some apples. I wonder if he'll eat an apple. I don't think he does. Anyhow, we'll leave it there, guys. As I said, we will try and... I think we'll go for another locked crate again tomorrow because we do need that extra cotton just for winter coming up, just so I can get a winter jacket and we'll be a lot more secure in moving about the place. And then we can get a combat vest. I'd like to have a combat vest before I go and tackle the hunters. Even now, I don't have enough for combat vest. The combat vest is five padded cloth. So we're... One pa well, one cotton short, unfortunately. We got this uh, rope easily enough, the little sinew we got, and the alloy sheets won't be too much of an issue. So yeah, we'll leave it there for now, guys. We'll go continue to hunt for more cotton tomorrow. Cotton's always going to be the big issue in making all this sort of stuff. But yeah, maybe with a little bit of luck, we'll find some. Fingers crossed. See how we go. Anyhow, guys, I will catch you next time. It's been Taeus Gaming, and yeah, I will see you tomorrow. See you later, guys.